What's going on? This is Marcus from Shattered Sun, and we're blowing it up with Capital Chaos TV. Turn it up. Hey, this is Ann Pirate with Capital Chaos TV. I am sitting with Marcus from Shattered Sun, and we're at Vans Warped Tour. Um, so you're from Alice, Texas. You guys have been a band since about 2005, and you just dropped your second album. Tell me a little bit about it. Yeah, uh, we just dropped it. It's entitled The Evolution of Anger. It's on Victory Records, our sophomore record, and uh, we're just excited for it to be out and us to be active and doing things because there was a lot of... Uh, a lot of personal turmoil that was going on that almost prevented the record from happening. So to ride that roller coaster and see it, you know, kind of take shape now, it's 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 really awesome because we worked really hard on it. That is cool. So now it's been out for a minute. You can kind of relax yeah. and just watch the response. Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, we were, we were really pissed off in the in the recording process. You know what I mean? So now we're in a better place and everybody's happy. And it's, it was kind of like therapy. We let it all out. So now we can just drink some beers and have a good time, you know. That's right. That's what's up. So, like, for the video, um, Burn It Down, I really like it. And the lyrics about digging your own grave, personally, I felt were very on point with what's going on with life and everything right now. So just to touch a little bit on the recent event with Lincoln Park and with Chester, people that are super affected by music and that you are able to influence with what you say, if anyone's watching this right now that is going through something personal or is struggling, what would you say to them? Uh, I'd, I'd say, you know, Focus on yourself, and, and it's okay to be selfish in life, you know, and, and do things that you want to do for yourself, you know. And if people think it's weird, you know, it's it's as simple as just saying, you know, fuck it, I'm going to do what the fuck I want to do, you know what I mean? And there's nothing wrong with that. We Like I said, we only go around this rock, you know, one time. So, you know, live it, you know, have have make the most out of what you can do in, in this life, you know. Mm -hmm. That's definitely what, I mean, we're from Alice, Texas. We're, we're oil field guys that shouldn't have even been doing this and and we're able to you know get out here and, and live our dreams so it anybody can do it anybody can do it just you got to do it though you know all right yeah. and here they are on their very first warp tour Woo! Yeah. so you've got just a few days left what are you guys going to do after the tour ends uh we have a headlining run uh with our label mates darkness divided from san antonio and we're going to do some uh west coast uh shows and head back to texas and then we got a couple of big tours to announce afterwards i can't say it right now ah, but gotta, stay gotta go check back in. yeah you got to check back in and you got to check out, out our social medias and you know we're going to be dropping some news pretty soon awesome, yeah. awesome. okay so tell me a little bit about this blood drive that you guys are involved in the music saves lives yeah we've uh we've done some signings with them and, and they're just a really great organization and I, I think it's it's helping these kids out here you know what i mean because there's there's you know from from all walks of life are out here. I'll, I'll say that from metal veterans to, you know, 11, 12 year old kids. You know what I mean? I think music is very powerful. I mean, that's why these kids are lined up, you know, at eight o'clock every morning, you know, burning themselves in the sun. So when they say music, say lives, they mean it. And, and we want to be behind that and they want to be behind us. So we're we're happy to be involved with them. That's awesome, dude. We're really, really grateful to have met you today. Thank you. Is there anything that you want to say to your fans or anything you want to share? Yeah, we're uh, we're appreciative of your support, and uh, make sure you go out and pick up the new record, The Evolution of Anger, out right now everywhere. Oh, what song would you want to have played at your funeral, if you could have any song in the world played? Ooh, man. Okay, it would be between George Strait, The Cowboy Rides Away, or mm, Mama, I'm Coming Home from Ozzy. Those are really rad choices, dude. Yeah, yeah that's, you know, I, I get a lot of grief for that, but uh, George Strait's like one of my biggest influences, and, you know, he's the king where I'm from, so, you know, definitely got to give him love. Right. <laughs> Best three albums of all time, in your opinion. Ooh. Jesus, okay. Uh, yeah, um, well, for me personally, uh, Machine Head, Through the Ashes of Empires, that record changed my life. Uh, the first Slipknot record, I feel deserves to be, you know, that's that's Hall of Fame worthy. They will be a Hall of Fame act because of that record. And uh, God, it's between Roots from Sepultura or Follow the Leader from Korn. But either of those, man, they just, they warped my mind and made me want to be a singer. So that that's that's my top three, you know. Hell yeah. Honorable mention to Kiss, uh, <laughs> Hotter Than Hell, because that's, that's one of my favorite records too.